Right, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to put the car into the brake pad sort of service mode. So I've got the full widescreen display. I've seen this on the internet quite a bit with just the normal dials. So this is how you do it with this one. So first off, what you do is you put the ignition on and um, you'll need to put it on so you get all the dials coming up. And then you need to put your foot on the, on the foot brake and release the handbrake normally, okay? If you haven't already done so. So I'm now going to go back to just the normal ignition. Now, whichever dials you have, you need to make sure that in the middle you've got the mileage reading. So if you've got the progressive display on this side here is where you want the normal trick computer lined up like that. And then what you need to do, because this is also a 2019, uh, 2019 model, so we've got the newer dials, is that with that display on the screen then, I'll try and put it on the angle. It might be a bit weird, but we'll get it all in. What you need to do is first off press this home button, so I'm pressing that with this finger, and then when all the menu up here changes, you then need to press this button in the middle, so you like this, one, two, boom. And then you'll see the display changes and it will say vehicle data, uh, dynamometer test, brake pad replacement. So you then just use your normal uh, keypad here to scroll up and down till you get to brake. Okay, so I've just done that with the touchpad. Press the button, press the OK. And then it says move to fitting position with OK. I don't know if the cameras pick that up, but you hear like a whirring noise and everything. OK, outside, and that's the caliper retracting. OK, so that's now the fitting position. And then when we've done it and get in the car, because we've probably been in here more than about 10 minutes outside the car, it will all have switched off. Just press the key on as you've got normally and you'll see this message in the windscreen and you press OK again. And you can see it says caution exiting fitting position. Uh, and it might take a couple of goes, it might, you'll hear about five, maybe even 10 seconds of whirring. And then it says fitting position has been exited, confirm with OK. And then you just use your normal button menus here uh, to reset and go back to your menus, scroll across to where, whatever you want in the middle there, like your normal uh, trip menu, and that's you done.